I'm Danielle and I'm a science facilitator here at Black Rock Castle Observatory. My main function is to get people excited about space and getting out into the night sky. It's a really unique structure here because it's the oldest surviving structure in Cork and it's got a lot of history, but people come here maybe a bit for the history, but they leave with a love of astronomy and the night sky. Black Rock Castle Observatory is actually an extension of the Cork Institute of Technology campus. So we do have active research that happens here and we have an in-house astronomer that works here at the observatory and we're in his lab right now. And then we have our head astronomer that works out at CIT on campus there. We get people interested in astronomy by having such an interactive exhibit. So when people come in, they get to learn a lot about science, mainly astronomy, mainly space science but it's a little bit of mixture of everything in the exhibit. And they end up getting interested in the exhibit and then end up in the planetarium. So that's really where it seals the deal and everyone pretty much walks away with a newfound respect for the night sky. The planetarium shows we have here at the castle are probably one of our biggest attractions because it's a live show. So that means we have somebody there explaining the night sky to you. You get to see what it's like from the perspective of Cork City every month. So it changes from month to month and it's not just for kids. The adults end up loving it, and a lot of times the adults end up asking more questions than the kids do after the show is over. <laughs> we have tours running every day, so you get a bit of the history here of Black Rock Castle, and you can come in and visit and do a tour which will take you up to the top of the tower where Observatory is as well. We have loads of different events throughout the year, so we'll have talks sometimes from different speakers and different fields of science, and then we also have open nights where people can come in and hopefully, on clear nights, get to see the night sky. We'll have telescopes set out in the courtyard, which is great for all ages. Adults love it, kids love it, everybody has loads of fun doing that. You're looking at different things depending on what's visible in the sky that night. So throughout the year, it could be all different things. It could be a planet that's visible. Sometimes we have Jupiter or Saturn in the sky, sometimes Mars or Venus and then other times it could be the moon and we always try to plan the moon nights based on the first quarter. It's the best time to look at the moon through a telescope and it's great fun for the kids.